Hello everyone. Hope you all are doing well. Today we will do the poem Trees from Honeycomb Book Lesson 5. The poem Trees is written by Shirley Bauer. Shirley Bauer was born on October 17, 1944 and died on May 17, 2011. She was a nurse by profession and was a baseball fan, loved traveling and spending time with her friends. This poem shows the love of the poet to the nature, to the trees. It's about the simple ways in which trees brings us happiness every day. Here, yeah. the poet lists down various advantages of the trees. So the central message of poem is that the trees are very essential. Here, anaphora poetic technique is used as successive lines begin with same word. As you can see, all the lines except this one, these two, all the lines begins with the same word that is trees. In such case, we say the poetic technique or the poetic device used here is anaphora. Okay, first I'll read the whole poem for you. Then I'll explain line by line. And this poem is very rhythmic in nature. Trees are for birds. Trees are are for children. Trees are to make tree houses in. Trees are to swing swings on. Trees are for the wind to blow through. Trees are to hide behind in hide and seek. Trees are to have tea parties under. Trees are for kites to get caught in. Trees are to make cool shade in summer. Trees are to make no shade in winter. Trees are for apples to grow on and pears. Trees are to chop down and call timber. Trees make mothers say, what a lovely picture to paint. Trees make fathers say, what a lot of leaves to rake this fall. Now, let me explain it. Trees are for birds. You know, birds live on trees. They make their nest and they survive. They live on trees. So, trees are for birds. Trees are for children. Trees are for children. Children love to play around tree. They love to climb on the trees. They love to throw stones and get the fruits from the tree. So basically, children love trees. Trees are to make tree houses in. So you have, must have seen in uh, wood areas, in forest regions and otherwise also people make tree houses. So trees are meant to make tree houses in. Trees are to swing swings on and children love to put swing on trees and sit and swing on that. So high touching the leaves of the trees. Trees are for the wind to blow through. Trees are for wind to blow through and create more air circulation. Trees are to hide behind in hide and seek. And when you are playing hide and seek in open, trees are the best hiding place, right? Trees are to have a tea parties under. It's so fun to have tea parties under the tree. You can go to the parks with your mats and sit under the shade of the tree. And it's so lovely and pleasant to sit there and have parties with the friends and family members. Trees are for kites to get caught in. So when you fly trees, it happens many a times that your kites got stuck, got get caught in the branches of the trees. And it's so fun to loot the caught kites of others. 
Trees are to make cool shade in summer and when you are tired and exhausted, it's so good to rest under the shade of the shade of the tree during summers, hot summers. Trees are to make no shade in winter, but in winters, though it makes shade, but we do not like sitting under the shade. In some winters, we always love to sit under the sun, not under shade. Trees are for apples to grow on and pears. Trees, on trees, there are many sweet and lovely fruits that grow for us. We can make use of all the fruits that we can get from the trees. Trees are to chop down and call timber. Once the trees are old enough, they are fully grown and it's like does not produce fruit. We can cut down those trees and make use for our furniture. And once the trees are chopped down, they are called timber. There are no more trees. Now they are called timber. And timber is used for making the furnitures that we have in our house. Trees make mother say, what a lovely picture to paint. So seeing the beautiful trees full of fruits, colorful flowers, the mother seeing the beauty of it says, wow, it's so lovely to paint a tree. They feel like painting and paint a tree. Trees make father say, what a lot of leaves to rake this fall. Fall means autumn season. Fall means here the fall. We are talking about the autumn season. The poet is mentioning during autumn season. However, trees make extra work for fathers. During autumn season, we see the leaves dry and tend to fall. And there is heap of leaves to be cleaned, which are shed by trees. Yeah, now what is a rake? Rake is a hand tool it's a thing of fork shape which is used for collecting the dried leaves or cut grass so this is all about the benefits or the advantages of trees that the poet wants to point this is poem trees by shirley bird thank you